Hey, this is Eric with Techno RV, and this is our external Wi-Fi booster tube. Now, one of the questions I get asked a lot about these is how to install them. So you're usually just left with maybe installing them uh, on your ladder rack, or if you have one of the bat wing antennas, you can put it on there. Uh, but then you have a usually have a long run with the cable. It comes with a 16-foot cable to get to the maybe the entry point of where you want it to enter your RV. So uh, we've come up with a solution for this. We got with the uh, the people over at Ghost Stick Products, and this is a heavy-duty suction cup mount, and we had them uh, put an additional bracket on here, and basically what you can do is you can install your antenna directly in these brackets, and we'll just go ahead and do this real quick. Just run this through here, just like that, and then you can easily tighten these down, just like this. What this gives you the ability to do, it gives you the ability to put your antenna right at your entry point on your RV. And for me, it's this slide out right here, okay? So what I've done is I've taken the cable and I've run it right inside of my slide. Okay, so usually if you'll just run your slide in three or four inches, you'll start to see light, uh, and then you can run the slide in real easily. So that's what I did. I pulled my slide in, ran the cable in, and then I pulled my slide back out. and. Uh, and then I just install this at the top of my slide out right here. So I'm going to climb a ladder and show you what it looks like. The install is super easy at this point. All I want to do is now mount this at the top of my slide. And to do this, I'm just going to take a damp cloth, wipe the area that I want to put the suction cup, wipe the suction cup with the damp cloth, place it where I want it to be, and then pull the handle in to activate the suction. That is not going anywhere. The other great thing is if you'll remember, I installed this cable right inside my slide. So now what I can do to make it a really clean install is I can just tuck this cable behind the gasket all the way down and you'll only see about maybe uh, six inches of the cable at that point. Uh, so this would be very good if my access point that I was trying to reach with this antenna was maybe out in this direction here. So it may not be as good as if, if the access point was on the other side of my RV. So you could do one of two things with that. You could go and you could take this suction cup mount and just go mount it on the other side of the RV if you knew that was the direction the access point was coming from. Or you can get some more extension uh, on this antenna to get it higher in the air. So I want to show you something that we recommend for people that they can do. You can get a one inch by five foot PVC pole. Then all you do is put the PVC pole in this bracket, and then you mount your antenna on top of the PVC pole. It's a great solution to make sure that you're getting good line of sight with your Wi-Fi. And I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now and show you what that looks like. This is now the ultimate solution. So we've got our suction cup mount right here, okay? And instead of putting the antenna directly into the brackets, we've got a one inch by five foot PVC pole. Now I put this in the bracket, and then I mount my antenna at the very top of that. And I do that with a couple of zip ties and they actually come with that external booster tube kit. And now my height is really good. It's gonna be great for my line of sight to the access point. So now whether my access point is over here or over on the other side of my RV, my antenna is well above my RV and any other RV in the park. So that's very important for line of sight as it relates to Wi-Fi. Also my install is very clean because I've mounted this so close to my uh, entry point that uh, you really can't even see the cable because I just tucked it in behind the gasket on the slide so that makes the install very clean and uh, also this will work for any antenna out there uh, we're talking about our external booster tube but if you've got some other kind of antenna that you need to get some height on this will work for that as well and uh, it's an exclusive you can only get it at Techno RV so go to TechnoRV.com today and get you one so this is the way that I installed it uh, with the slide out. You know, my entry points here, and uh, and then I just ran the cable behind this gasket all the way up and then popped it back out to uh, catch the antenna up top. So it's a real clean install. That you, know, you don't have cables hanging all over the place. And uh, But if, if you didn't have a, uh, a slide, you can certainly go uh, inside a window. A lot of people do that. Uh, you may have some other entry points, so you can kind of get uh, creative with this. But this is something when you get to a park, you need this system, you can pop it up real quick, 
run it in, and then of course it's not made to, to stay here while you're in motion. So before you leave, of course you need to take it back down. And uh, but anyway, we're real proud of this product. It's the uh, it's the suction cup antenna mount. You can get it at TechnoRV.com.